Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I will show you how to add discount pop-ups to your Shopify store. Offering discounts and promotions is a great way to boost sales and attract new customers. In this video, we will show you how to create eye-catching pop-ups that offer discount to your store visitors and increase your chance of making a sale. So let's dive in. Make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. So, first of all, what I will need you to do guys is simply go ahead and launch your browser. Right after that, go ahead and click into the URL section over here in whatever browser you are using and search for Shopify. Here we go. And let me just remove this PNG. And here it is. So this is the website that we are going to use. Now let me just go and add English so we have the English website and the version of it. And here it is over here. So all I'm going to do is click on it. Now this is the website and for us to actually have a store all we need to do is click on one of these start free trail button. So there is one over here and the other is in the top right corner of the page. So let's try and click on it. Here they will give us like a question and answers. So we have to answer some questions of theirs. First of all, they will ask us which of these best describes you. For me, I'm just starting. Then click on next. Where would you like to sell? For example, there is an online store, an existing website or blog, social media, online marketplaces, in person. Here you can click if you're not sure yet where you want to sell. For me, I'm going to choose and pick an online store. Let's go to here and click on next. Now, what do you plan to sell first? Products I buy or make myself, digital products, dropshipping products, services, print on demand products, or I will decide later. So let's click on I will decide later for now because I'm not sure yet. And now let's give our store a name. So here let's name it for example, tutorial video. Let's wait until they check everything and they give us the authority to use it and then click on next. Now let's choose the region, next again. And finally here we have to create the Shopify ID. The Shopify ID is used like to log into your account. So you can log in using an email and password, Apple ID, Facebook or even Gmail account. For me I'm going to use Gmail account because it is easier for me. So let's click in here, then let me pick my Gmail account. And here I am. Now they are building our store and it can take between 10 to 40 seconds maximum. It is not that long and don't worry guys, the dashboard is pretty easy to use. It is so simple and I will take you through it step by step. So don't worry about anything. Here as you can see, you have your free trade that will be ended at 9th of April so make sure to get your premium version of, Sh of Shopify uh, before 9th April because your shop will be extended and closed the, f the, the premium version will cost you only one dollar so it is not expensive at all now let's start with installing the application and now guys what I will specifically need you to do is Simply just go over here Click on apps and then they will take you to this angle like over here All you have to do is click on recommended apps. So after right after you click on it click on Shopify app store and They will take you to a new page Here all you have to do is search for discount code and it must appear for you. So here it is, discount code, discount pop-up. So click on it. Then before we start with adding the application, let me show you like the demo store, how it's gonna look like. So this is like the demo store of a store that is using this um, like discount application. So basically once you open the 
think you will have a discount so for me as you can see i didn't appear any discount because i have like the actual um ad block and ad card on but once you actually open the page it must give you like the discount and etc and basically all you have to do is add it so how we can add it just click on add application this is a brief like picture of how it's gonna look like so this is like the pop-up so here it is these are like three more as you can see so yeah now let's add it simply by clicking on add application and we are going to be ready to go now here click on install app let's go back and from here it is very simple let's pin it to make it easier to get to and to reach and now you will have to choose one of their plans there is the basic one the plus one and of course the prime one let's go with the free one which is the basic one so sign up for free and now let's wait a little bit until the page loads and here we go you can start the tutorial we have created an easy process that will help you to get started with zp in under two minutes so to get started with creating your offer pop-ups and converting more customers so let's start with this tutorial by clicking here and let's follow them one by one so let's click here to create an offer here you have to give offer name so discount next here where do you want to show the, uh, the offer group so our pages here um, pop-up type so discount pop-up exit instant entry pop-up so discount pop-up next offer trigger rules when cut has any product when cut has specific products when cut has specific collection and uh, so it's up to you so let's choose for example when cut has has any product so let's keep it like that how offers get applied express checkout with offer continue shopping automatically apply discount code at checkout so continue and then click on next step here you have to choose like the theme that you are going to use i will choose this one and click on next step so as you can see customizing the theme it is now up to you so you can customize everything like literally everything as you can see um you can drag a color uh, drag and drop files so for example let's try to drag this image and let's click on done uh, this is less like an idea here you can change the text itself how much like the discount is and even the button itself so it is completely up to you now when you finish with that click on next step here you must put the discount amount that you are going to give which is for example 20 percent here discount code new one because it's not existing and then click on next enter the discount you want to offer i already did and here additional filters for example limit number of products a customer can buy you can turn it on or off offer free shipping with the current offer nope and then click on next step here some extra rules for example show it to customers only once so we can make it off or on it is up to you which means when a customer actually adds some products in their cart it's not going to like every time they add the product will show it for you for him so here i preferably turn it on so let's click on next and then save the offer and you will be all done so here the conversion so offers display uh, so every offer that has been displayed for a customer it will be showed in here here the dashboard where you can see the analytics and the graphics as you can see here it will be over here like the graphs and the estimated revenue that you made using this and much more so this is completely it guys and before we end this video there is some other popular ads by the same uh like app which is which by the same company they are are very good if you'd like to merge them together and the most important thing guys it is make sure that zp is enabled don't let it be disabled if it is disabled like so make sure to turn it on and make it enable like that and yeah this is completely it if you'd like to change the plan you can go here and buy one of these if you'd like to turn off offer you can just go here and turn it off and everything is now up to you and just go with it just go crazy with it do your offers make it look very cool and get your revenues and 
like that we have reached the end of this video guys so thank you a lot for watching if you had or faced any kind of problem make sure to leave it down below in the comment section and see you guys in the next tutorial